Hi there, this is Nianel, and I want to thank you for taking the time to listen to me today. Today I want to open my heart as a parent, and I want to share a letter that I wrote for my children. To my beautiful children, in the heat of the moment, I was only human, and I reacted exactly the way I was treated as a child. In my own hurt and pain, I pushed what I thought was hurting me away. I forgot that you were only children and that I was supposed to hold it together. I became a child in that heated moment, overwhelmed with a feeling that I never get what I want. I'm so sorry that I caused you pain from my own place of hurt. I can't change what is done. I can't. I can only forgive myself and hope that you will as well. I listen as you tell me how you feel. But all I hear is how I failed you and it breaks my heart. I was so hoping to be a better parent than what my parents were to me, but turns out I'm not doing any better or any worse really. And now, now I know how they must have felt. I can understand their frustration and now understand that they did their best from their own place of hurt and pain. They gave me so much more than what their parents gave them. Just like I gave you so much more than what my parents gave me. And I'm sure that they thought, just like I'm thinking now, you have it so easy and yet you don't appreciate it. But how can you appreciate something when you have not yet experienced the lack of it? I'm so thankful for this realization. I'm so thankful for my parents. I now fully understand and know just how much they did for me. How hard they've tried. How much they've loved me. How they must have regretted their own outbursts when they could not hold it together when their inner child was screaming to get what they needed, but never got it. Mom, Dad, please forgive me. I was just a child. And I forgive you, because I know now it was only your inner child reacting in pain. We are truly all just doing our best with the knowledge and self-awareness we have at the time. And as I hear myself defending myself, when you accuse me or blame me for your pain and hurt, or even when you are just trying to tell me how you feel, and I immediately feel that I have failed you as a parent, please, may I just be there for myself in those vulnerable moments. May I be gentle and loving with myself. May I remember my worth, my value. May my inner child be embraced and protected by my adult self. And may I take nothing personally. May I remember to love myself like I need you to love me in that moment. May I remember that you are only reflecting my inner child back to me. And however I react, may I love that part of me. And however you react, may I love that part of you. We are all just screaming out for love and acceptance. That is all we need. Love and acceptance. My children, when you tell me how much you are hurting, and how you sometimes hurt yourself. My heart bleeds for you because I cannot help you or save you. Only you can do that. I have no power when it comes to your joy and your happiness. Only you have the power to create your own joy and happiness. So I do the only thing I can do for you, my beautiful angels. I believe in you. I believe that you will overcome the challenges of loving and accepting yourself and allowing yourself to be happy. I believe in you. There is nothing else I can do. And I trust that the eternal, unconditional source of all creation that is within you will become present in your reality. 
so that you will never ever have to feel alone or lonely again. And that you will know that you have the freedom to tap into that energy of creation within you and create the most beautiful, fulfilling and most satisfying life for yourself because you are so worthy and so deserving. You are divine. And I am so thankful that I get to experience the magnificence of you. My children. I love you unconditionally and for all eternity.